Okay, so we've built this little circuit up now. The problem that I'm getting is uh, one, I stuck a whole bunch of transistors in the wrong way around. Um, for some reason, I've marked it down on here the wrong way, but that's the correct way for the BC uh, 557, and that's 547B1. For some reason, I got those the wrong way around. But anyway, enough about that. So anyway, so here it is, but we don't seem to be getting a lot now. I've tried using this for a coil. I tried using uh, this, and none of it makes any difference. At the minute, I've actually got this AM aerial antenna on there. Shoved it over there, but. So what I'm going to do, because we don't seem to have any signals that can, you know, be distinguished. Um, just turning that back the other way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect the circuit here, and I'm going to inject a signal into there. Now. I built this. Oh. I built this little um, flip-flop circuit, which is going to produce a, a signal, and I should be able to use this lead. If I remember this correctly, this. Oh no, this is the power in. This is the probe side, and this is the earth. So I'm hoping I can connect this up to the ground, and then I can use this probe. Um, to inject the signal and see if we get any anything more um, recognised out of this. So let's give it a go. See what we can do with that. Okay. So I've just connected this up. Now if I connect to the base of this transistor, so we know the amplifier side is working. That's a bit weird. So it does work. Okay, but it's just not... We, we just haven't got a signal um, that's working very well for it now. I can't remember whether it, it said that it's supposed to use decent transistors. These are just cheap. Um, I think I got a hundred for a pound, including the shipping from China of these 547s. So it could be something to do with that, I'm not sure. But it's nice to see that my little probe works. Because we do get a straight audio tone. Which is good. I don't know why on this PMP though, it's not doing the same thing there. But they're alright. They're okay. You can hear like the oscillation type. I really don't know what I'm doing, I'm just trying to figure out what I can as I go along, so, uh, you know, if you're expecting to see some sort of professional doing this, who knows what he's doing, that, that's not what you got with me, I'm, I'm just learning, just learning how to play around with this stuff, so, I'm just experimenting and just playing, but I'll, um, I'll see what else I can do with this and see if I can get this to, to work a bit better. Okay, so what I've done is I've just connected up this old phone and I've literally just put the wires underneath the um, we've got the coupling capacitor there as you can see and uh, the negative there so <clears throat>
So it's not the greatest, but it is amplifying. It tells me the circuit's working, but it is. It's, it's not very good. I don't know if it's because it could do with some more input power. I'm not sure. Um, I'm going to have to play around with that a little bit. So that side works. So we've got to just try and get the detector side working. I'll assume it's something to do with all this. Um, but I'm not quite sure. I'm sure it's going to be a case of just having to play around. Um, even though that's quite distorted, it's not very good at all, really. Um, it has got something out that end, which is a which is a bonus. So, if I'm looking at that and see what happens, to get anything else to come out of it. <laughs> 